What is up guys, Ashton here. Today we have a good chance there's going to be a thunderstorm today. As you can tell, I'm in the skies already. Um, and we are going to be monitoring this. Hopefully later in the afternoon, we're going to be getting some thunderstorms. And we are going to be storm chasing, hopefully. And uh, we've been going out. And we're going to see what weather we can find today. And uh, uh, I'm going to probably interrupt you guys for some breaking news. Um, you guys are probably going to really enjoy this news. Um, so yeah, we're going to get out there, go storm chasing, and see what happens. Take care. I'll be right back. As you can see, guys, we have one cell, two cells, three cells, four cells, five cells, six cells right here. And the seventh one is to the north. Then we got eight right there. We are surrounded by cells right now. They're not super cells, quite frankly, but they are definitely... This one and that one are definitely wrapping up right here. We're gonna keep our eye on that. And you can see the leading edge of the shelf cloud on that one. Um, but we're gonna see which one starts first. Hopefully it's this one or this one because I can't get to that one or that one or that one or that one. The only three, four that are coming this way is gonna be this one, that one, that one, and that one. So we're gonna see what we got coming for us. You already can see the wall cloud forming on this one right there. And we got a leading edge of another wall cloud that's converging in from this uh, second cell right here. Uh, the rest are not looking too promising at the moment, but we de I definitely have faith in this one or that one doing something. So let's figure it out. What is up guys, amateur storm chaser Ashton here. Actually, not one, not one, not two, but we are looking at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different cells right now that have just sprouted up. Um, the one to the east right now is actually got a thunderstorm on it. Not actually a thunderstorm, but it's got a thunderstorm. The one to the northeast also has a thunderstorm on it. This one right here, I think that was just lightning. That might have just been lightning. That one's gonna be a thunderstorm any second. And the one to the north looks like it's about to be a thunderstorm also. You can definitely see the wall cloud back in there. There's a rain curtain to the direct northeast, not north, north northwest. Um, and you can see the shelf cloud forming right there. Um, but we're going to turn our attentions actually over to the one that is coming from the northwest. And you can definitely just see what I'm talking about by it's going to be coming a thunderstorm here. We are hot on the trail. We got a shelf cloud right under there. Uh, we got more shelf cloud forming back in there. And then you just got the rain curtains just forming right, right about here. Um, I am really positive about this one right now. So... We gotta keep an eye on it. If it does lightning any second, uh, we're gonna be on the, we're gonna be in chase mode. But yeah, you can just see all these little cells everywhere just lining the sky, which is really cool. So we're gonna, we're gonna keep our eyes on this one right here and see what's going on. We're gonna be interrupting this storm chase here with some the news, this news is just so unbelievable, you guys. Um, so, and what, what better to break, way to break the news while you're sitting in front of a thunderstorm? So, uh, let's see, was it, two, yeah, two Mondays ago, uh, I was taking out the trash, actually, and uh, there was a little box, I'll, uh, I'll put the box on screen for you to see right now. Um, so this box, it was uh, on the porch, you see. I was taking out the trash, I was sitting on the bench, the old bench of the porch is right here, and uh, this is the door. So I was walking out, I saw the box, and I was like, oh, this is the mail. Uh, so I take the trash out, the can, and I uh, came 
back and look at the box, I'm like, this box, it says, a little box of big news. And I'm like, what is this? And I'm like, no, this can't be it. And so I take it aside. I, I, I didn't, I didn't, I, I was screaming on the porch. I was literally screaming on the porch because I, I had a feeling it was it. Uh, so I did that. And of course, I, I didn't read it up. Our right now our neighbors probably think I'm a crazy man for screaming on the porch. So I, look, I didn't look at it until I fully got inside. And I was like yelling, Mom, Dad, Mom, come here. But then I looked at it, it was like University of Oklahoma. I... I did it guys. I'm going. I'm going to Oklahoma. We're not just gonna be seeing this. We're gonna be seeing tornadoes. We're gonna be seeing blizzards. Crazy things that you guys have never seen on this channel or that you ever, you guys probably didn't even think I was had any college plans because I'm so into this YouTube thing and everything I'm doing. But no, I I freaking this has been my dream since I was three years old. I have wanted to go there since I was young. It happened, guys. It happened. We're going. I, I just, I, I, I don't know what to say. I, I want to thank every one of you who support me. Everyone who believes in me. Everyone that has stayed with me. I want to thank all my teachers. I want to thank everyone. Every single person. Except ten times bigger than this. Ten hundred times bigger than this. This, this is minuscule to the storms we're gonna see. And I'm just so excited to go. Reed Timmer, my inspiration. I uh Back in 2007, when it first aired, I, I instantly was captivated. I was, I was three, four years old. Well, three years old technically. Uh, I don't know. Whatever. But no, I was literally the first episode debuted on Discovery, and I was like, I yes, I was, I was four years old. Yeah, four. I was four. I've been fascinated with it since I was three. But when it came out, I was like, this is it. This is a, I, you think I'm crazy. I, I, at four years old, I had a plan. A plan to go to University of Oklahoma, like Reed Timmer, graduate, become a storm chaser. Well, technically it's called a field meteorologist, but you guys know what. But it's just unbelievable that I've come 14 years later, almost 14 years later, and I'm going to be in Oklahoma chasing storms. I, I, I can't believe it's happening. It's, it's literally a dream come true, if you think about it. But we are not stopping. We are not stopping this channel. You guys, you, we're sticking in the ride. You guys are going to be doing everything I do in college. Yeah, I might not be posting as often as I would like to. But it's still going to be a heck of a fun time being with you guys on the journey. You guys are going to be on my journey with me. It's going to be so much fun. Though. I don't cry a lot, but this... This is the, pro the biggest thing in my life so far that's happened. I will guarantee you that's the biggest thing in my mic just fell over. But, you know, this is the biggest thing. Hold on. There's some strong gusts coming in. Uh, 
yeah, this is the biggest thing that has happened so far in my life. And it's... I'm just so happy and excited. I already got a $20,000 scholarship for tuition. And it, it, it's, I, it's unbelievable. I, 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 didn't, I thought I should just break it to you in front of weather, of course. Did you know it? And no, I'm not, I'm not putting chill. I'm still going to be playing chill. I'm hopefully going to join the music program and stuff uh, and be a part of that. Uh, but we're not playing show, we are not playing weather, we are going for, we are going to complete my goal and lifelong dream. We are going to Oklahoma, and we are going to be seeing a whole lot more of this, except bigger and way cooler. This, I, I just don't know. It's, it, it, this is probably going to be, if no other storms happen, this is probably going to be the last one you see in California. And yeah, I'm, I'm staying in Oklahoma. I can't, I can't live here anymore. For reasons uh, I cannot tell, because that will probably get me uh, demonetized, you know. But no, it's not anything bad. It's just I hate it here. I literally do. I love everyone here. I love my parents. I just, California's not for me anymore. Oklahoma is a good place. I live, hopefully for the rest of my life. And we're gonna, we're gonna be having so much fun there. Just get a good look around you guys. This could be the last one you see here. The southern winds are pushing. This might be it. Uh, it's the last storm of California. Mark this day, March 10th. Mario. Mario Day. It is Mario Day, yes. Um, but this is, this could be it. And I'm proud to say goodbye to California. I'm going to be moving out late in July, early August. Uh, my first day of school starts in August. person too so that's a really good benefit uh, I, we're, we're gonna do a hopefully we're gonna be doing a journey tour you know <laughs> don't date no we're, we're no we're actually gonna be doing a journey tour on our way there uh i don't know if we'll be driving or flying but i'd like to drive so we can go through uh nevada i've been in nevada quite a few times Las Vegas a few times, but uh, hopefully we're gonna go through Nevada. Hopefully, uh, if if we do drive, we're gonna probably hit Nevada, Utah, I think through Colorado, through the Rockies. Uh, that'll be fun seeing all the the super diverse climate changes on our way there, and then Oklahoma. I think we actually, uh, we, I think we'll go through the Texas Panhandle. Norman, we're going into Norman. So, yeah, we're going to be in Norman. Uh, National Weather Center is actually on campus. And we, we're going to be staying there. Not, not staying, I guess we'll say, but we, that's uh, where the meteorology program is. Um, we're going to be hopefully getting into that. I, I don't know if it's sophomore or junior year. Um, but we're going to get into that. As a freshman, we get to stay in the dorms uh, for a freshman year. But that doesn't really matter to me because I want to be on campus. I want to get the feel, the diversity of everyone there. It's going to be so much fun. It's a really nice wind. I like it. It is a constant blowing. Look at this grass. I don't know if you can see the grass. It's blowing. Yeah, you can see the, the alfalfa field. Whipping in the wind. Uh, but yeah, you're going to see a lot more of too, probably. <laughs> but yeah, you guys, I, I, I can't believe this is going to be happening. I, I, I really genuinely I can't. It, it's, it's, it's my dream, and it's going to become a reality here. So uh, I, I can't wait to get there and uh, just experience it. You guys are going to get a campus tour, 
So it's everything super close. Probably, it's everything on campus is within walking distance and not bike riding distance. It is a big campus, but it's not like UCLA, uh, Stanford, all those like Hartford, whatever, all those gigantic colleges. It's not, not, this is not nearly as big. So it's, I think, uh, the, this building on campus is like a mile away from the dorms. But yeah, you guys are gonna give a nice campus tour. Um, uh, hopefully, I'll go to a football game. Um, but you guys can see how crazy college football games are. Yeah, and if you watch them, you probably already know that, that they're crazy. Um, but yeah, I'm just walking in this field right now because why not? Feel the dreams. It is a feel the dreams indeed. Not feel the dreams in the movie, which even though that is a, one of my favorite baseball movies. But it's this, this is gonna be one heck of a journey, guys. And I can't wait for you guys to come along with me. Um, so yeah, this will be it for this video. Well, uh, nothing happened in the background, as I hoped, um, but this, that, that's, that's the life of a storm chaser. You got good days and you have bad days. Some days you won't have anything, other days it's going to be EF5 on the ground, mile wide tornado plowing through. Um, or days that are just completely sunny and you got no cloud in sight. That's the life of a storm chaser, my friends. So, yeah. it just, this, this just captivates me. It can, the weather just captivates me. There's science behind it. Just look at it. It's just so beautiful. Look at this. It's just beautiful. The, the beauty behind it. The thrill. Everything. I want to be able to protect the public and let them know what's going on in the weather so they're not in harm's way. That's that's another thing of storm chasing. You gotta have the the, the public informed. They gotta call in dangerous weather, anything like that. You gotta call it in, make sure the public is aware and safe. And yeah, and show how it affects people in their lives. Cause you know, this crop is in the air. It, hail, hail destroys more crops than any other weather. You got drought, also will destroy crops. You got flooding. Makes the earth go wet. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then you got tornadoes. Or you got yeah, all this weather. All this weather. It's, it, it affects our everyday lives. Guys, every day of our lives, there is some sort of weather happening in the world. No matter where you live, there is some type of weather. It, it's just awesome. It's awe-inspiring. What's going to be happening? So this, this, it's coming, guys. We're, we're going, and I really can't wait. So that's going to wrap it up. Uh, I'm sad nothing really happened. This, this could be the last storm system type thing you see in California before I leave. Um, or you know, you know, when I visit. If my parents and brothers stay here, which they are most likely, but you never know. Something could happen on a day I come. There's a chase in here again. But, yeah. Yep, indeed. I just want to thank you all again. single one of you guys from the bottom of my heart not in that way silliest but as friends followers subscribers all of you who watch me and care about me I want to thank every single one of you every single one of you for everything you guys have done for me so yeah 
Yep, indeed. Alrighty, guys. We are in chase mode right now. We have a strong thunderstorm that has intensified finally uh, to the north. And we are watching it. I just got some lightning. I punched through the hail floor uh, earlier, about 20 minutes ago. Uh, and now we are just sitting here watching it. But there is definitely lightning. Minor traffic, uh, we're on a busy street. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, lighting back there. Definitely saw some more. Uh, let's try it. God, so let there be lightning now, please, to the north. Game time, you good? Yes, got some. Alright, we're gonna take you guys down from the car. Hold on. Alright, we're gonna put you on the hood. Yes, you got it. <laughs> Actually, no, I'm gonna use you guys in the hand. I'm gonna put you guys in the hand. Here we go. All right, you want to try, let's try one more time. Ahem. Oh yeah, by the way, there's the hail core right there. Ahem. Thank God, so let it be lightning now, please, to the north. <clears throat> Any time be good. Lightning strike. Oh yeah. Oh yes! Woo! Yes! Got another one. 
Yes! Yes! What if this truck would let me get on top of his roof? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Guys, uh, let there be lightning now, please. To the north or northwest. <clears throat> Anytime, we good. Lightning strike. Yes! <laughs> yes! Yes! The trick is working. 100% on the trick today. We are three for three. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Let's see what we're gonna zoom in here. We're gonna zoom in right there. That's where it's happening. Oh yeah, there's thunder. Yes! There's another! Let there be lightning now, please, to the north or northwest. Daytime, you good? Trick didn't work that time. All right, we're four for five on the trick. Four for trying. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. Yes. Four. Okay, hello. We're gonna put you guys back on the hood because uh, I'm not getting some of the lightning. All right, there we go. Try that. going off back in there. You can just see all the lightning happening. This is awesome. What happens when you go out storm chasing? This is awesome. Alright, I gotta put my hood on. It's a little chilly. Lightning. We are getting all of it. We just parked right here on the side of the road. We got the whole north. The entire north to watch. And that's where it's all happening. Perfect. Perfect area to watch. Ashton is big friend. We are Lightning now, please, from the north. Yes! Yes! Five for six! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! We are five for six. I think you guys are better off 
on the roof. Pull up. Now you guys don't see all the cars passing by. Alright, putting you guys on the roof. Here we go. It is going off the chain. I hope we are getting this. I hope the camera is recording this. We are getting all the lightning. So let there be lightning now, please, the north or northwest. <clears throat> Anytime again. Lightning strike. Anytime, please. Oh, wait, one more. Ready, lightning strike. All right. Five for seven. Not bad. Still not bad. Five for seven is not bad. There be lightning now, please. To the, I mean, excuse me. And God said, let there be lightning now, please. To the north. Um. Anytime we good. Lightning strike. Strike three. <laughs> A bowling strike. You know. One last movie. Lightning strike. Thank you. All right. Five for eight. We're still, we're still uh, over par, right under par. We're still playing a good golf game. Pretty fast paced. It's moving along pretty far nicely. Alright. I know a lot of lightning's happening probably right back in there. Um it's super it's a, it's a rainmaker. A definite rainmaker. Uh, cause the you can see the hail core. There's another hail, not a hail core, but just the hail shaft right there. And you, you can just see all these super low condensation right here. All this, that's that's part of the shelf cloud. It's super duper low condensation, and that's just that's just what's shrouding the lightning out, which is uh, making my visibility less likely to see lightning. Sucks. 
look at the updraft into this thing. It's it's enormous. This is an enormous storm. And it's looking pretty clear everywhere else. Oh um, my. Ah, yeah. That was electrifying. <laughs> my terrible puns. I think that's all we're going to be able to see, guys. Uh, just because, if you see down there, right around here, it's breaking up. And yeah, you can just see right above us right here, it's just it's breaking up gradually. So I don't think we're going to get any more lightning off this. If we do, I'll be watching still. And then we'll start recording again. But yeah, uh, this is an awesome storm chase. I'm very, very glad. Very glad we did this. So I punched through the hail core. I, cut, uh, I was underneath the big old monster shelf cloud uh, for a while. Then uh, it, it died away. It actually formed a pretty nice rainbow. That one disappeared. And then a uh, big old giant double rainbow started forming. And then we could just see the hail core and hail shaft off in the distance um, which is uh, what we see over here that's what all that was and uh, now we're just watching this thunderstorm right die away gradually I think it's actually moving this way if you, if you can see it it's, it just seems really close I think it's moving uh, south southwest maybe southeast southeast probably I think yeah Storm chase today. Good job.